babies, you know, like, it's so, you, it's almost like you see everything. It's like, you know, like the bones, you know, the, the, you know, the, the sacks and they move and everything, you know, you, you feel like, you feel like the, the molecular structure, it just feels like a bag, it's gonna, tea bag, it's just gonna rip open and like, slop is just gonna come out, you know, and, uh, Hi, it's Matt again. I lost some balloons. Uh, apparently some kid was popping some of my balloons, so I had to come here and sit near the balloons to watch him. Anyhow, I got about... Uh, looks like I still have 11 balloons, so we're doing good. I, uh, yeah, one of my first roles on the NBC movie was I played uh, Azim, a distant relative of Bin Laden. I blew myself up, and I remember I was like, well, this is going to be a long career of playing terrorists and murders and... That's not true. You can play Spanish guys. Okay, so here's here's some really cool people like I just met at uh, Bellwood Park. Yay! Yay! And they caught me um, setting up my proposal. So let's uh, let's hang in there for the next two hours and Yay! let's see what happens. Yay! Woo, 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 woo. She'll get out, but afterwards people start doing this kind of thing. Yeah, like dancing. we all rush like around. Some participation. And... Oh, I see. Yeah, yeah, everybody gets that'll into bring it. to the energy of for the film. We all do like a, you know how win the World Series and everyone mocks yeah. the pitcher? Like, like the that's what, that's what yeah, 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 yeah. Game seven, we're exactly. all fucking partying in the middle. Or something. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. Um, this is uh, this is Trinity Bellwood marriage proposal, uh, August 31. And it's gonna be to a journey song. So we'll see how that goes. I wish you wrote this down here. Fake ass resume. A fake ass shit. That's going to do. It's gonna be a real short day today. F fake ass shit. I don't know. Dude, what is it? This is called camera. I shoot. I make shit. Can The goddamn fucking baker. Why has been bitching all day? I gotta be honest. Don't I have a right to? They should have the bus. No, dude, I get there early. I get there before you. You show up late. Dude, I show up late. The two more, most important people are showing up late. I'm just an actor. These guys are late. I'm look. No, who's to say they're supposed to be there early? It's absurd. That's what I'm saying. All I know. You told me to be there at fucking three o'clock. I was only fucking ten minutes late, and, and everyone else what an hour and a half late. Come and on. who's running it? Who's not really me. running it? Don't yell at me, man. Yell at everybody else. That's not me. They can do whatever. They can show up three hours late. We're they working for that. They can just fuck us around. That's what you're saying. They can just fuck uh, us okay, around. Why? Why? I'm the one who can come late because I'm the producer. My job is not All right, to be I, here. Dude, right I understand. Now. You're here to fix things. I'm here to this make guy's sure a this fucking dude joker. And he yeah, 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 la 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 la. Drugged out eyes. So, hey guys, my name is Mike Estes, and I'm here talking to you today about our new movie, and it's called The Hollywood Hoax. Now that we're together, Sabrina and I, I sometimes catch guys looking at her, and uh, that's just fine, you know, it's just part of getting used to the whole spiel. Sometimes I'll uh, follow them home and uh, to where they live. And, and just look inside their window, the way they were looking at my girl. And uh, yeah, I'll, I'll think a lot of thoughts. And that enhances our relationship. Right, sweetheart? Yeah. I think all these people are just some actors faking it because if you're in a line to go to MasterChef, you should be in a line. Like, these people are just in a bunch. I don't understand. These people are all paid actors, and Sabrina's not even here. I'm making a Chinese dish. What is the Chinese dish? The Vietnamese summer rolls with Thai chili chicken, julienne cucumber, carrot. Ah! Ah! Make y'all picture perfect. Uh, scallion, cilantro, um, a peanut sauce, and um, an Asian dip. Well, because that's where they're gonna give her a wrist then. Apparently the latest word is she's gonna be chopping up the ingredients outside since most of us can't come in with her. So we're gonna get a little taste ahead of the uh, schedule. 
Oh yeah, I just wanted to say just how proud I am of Sabrina coming out here and having the courage to do this. I mean, she's only 21 and yet she is just uh, taking, she, she's just doing what a lot of people don't do and that's just taking the punch. So, wish her the best of luck. He's on the peanut butter jar, my teddy. <laughs> it's free advertising. <laughs> <laughs> You'd be amazed at how much, how many things you notice just watching people, you know, just in the little frame that happens in a span. How much you can pick up all these details. Just sit in the parking lot sometime and take a look. You know, really notice a lot of things that we, we don't see. Most people don't see every day. Sometimes I can sit here for days. Sabrina asked where I am. You know, this is this is one of the places just sitting in a parking lot you know taking a look at people it's so beautiful lovely it's uh, ever changing like look at it, look at this car right here isn't that is that phenomenal that's a that's a piece of work that's somebody that's a couple of people's lives sent around this car you know lives that you can get in there without being a part of and really understand what goes on you know they're 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 willing to share their lives with you publicly. That's perfectly okay. You know, just sit in a parking lot sometime and take a look and work with that. And uh, yeah, that's that's what. Oh, hi, hi, sweetie. I'm just uh, sitting in the parking lot watching people. What what's going on in the trunk? Uh, Matt, why don't you fix this one? You just bought the there's a, there's a body in the trunk. Matt, you're a father. Robert, I'll you. Okay. So don't you take this out. She's cool with it if I'm cool. 